The bad news is the third most common cancer among both men and women in the U.S. occurs most often in people over the age of 50. The good news is there's a screening that can save lives. Dr. Lloyd Cook is here with the details. Dr. Cook is the Assistant Medical Director at Medical Mutual of Ohio. So welcome to our show mm -hmm. here today. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Laura. So what kind of cancer is this we're talking about? Well, we're really talking about colorectal cancer. And that's a cancer that involves the colon and the rectum and originates there. Um, found early, it's very treatable and um, curable. Hmm? All right, so we need to get the screening. So how does the screening help prevent the cancer? Well, screening is usually done with a colonoscopy. Um, and by doing early screening, you can pretty much pick up early signs of cancer. Um, usually, people have no signs, so that's hard, sometimes why it's hard to get people to go. But when you find precancerous lesions like polyps, which are abnormal growths in the colon, um, these can be readily uh, treated and with a 90% cure rate. Ooh, whoa. Find them, get rid of them, mm -hmm. you're good to go, huh? So, um, as you said, the test is a colonoscopy. So what does that really mean? What is involved in a colonoscopy? Well, a colonoscopy involves the looking and the lining of the colon and rectum. So, you know, generally they use a scope and they go up to the rectal area through the colon and they look for abnormal growths such as polyps. Now, polyps are pre-cancer, can be precancerous lesions and at the time they're found, they can usually be removed right on the spot. Mm, okay, and we've talked about um, this cancer usually happens in folks over 50, so is that when the screenings start? Well, we do recommend screening after age of 50 um, by multiple guidelines. Um, there are certain individuals that you may have to start earlier than that, and if you have a family history of, of, of colon cancer or any hereditary conditions that may predispose you to that, we start colonoscopy sooner. Okay, it can save lives and people should recognize that. However, a lot of people kind of dread it because of the prep work. Right. So isn't it getting better though to these days? Yes, the traditional prep um, was uncomfortable. It wasn't painful, but you know, when you had to drink a whole bunch of stuff in a short period of time, people had difficulties with it. But now there's multiple areas, other preps we can use now, laxatives, um, um, powders, pills, even split preparations now for um, prepping you for the colonoscopy. So it's not quite so bad. Not as bad as the it night used to before be. you go in the next morning. <laughs> right. Mm. <laughs> okay. Screening so saves lives, but if we want to try to avoid that all in the first place, what kind of steps should we take? Well, generally speaking, you want to have a healthy lifestyle. So what you want to do is avoid, you know, processed foods, red meats. Um, you want to exercise. You want to maintain a ideal weight. Um, you want to avoid smoking and limit your alcohol intake. Okay, kind of like keeping a healthy lifestyle for every other kind of yeah, every medical problem, issue, right? Exactly, and that's correct. <laughs> All right, <laughs> great tips for us. Colorectal cancer may be common, but it can often be caught before it starts, thanks to colonoscopy screening. To learn more, use the information that's coming up next. My thanks to Dr. Cook for joining us today. Thank you. Learn more about Medical Mutual of Ohio by calling 1-844-606-5387 or visit www.medmutual.com go.